Hello everybody, what is up? This is Minecraft, Direwolf 21.19, modded Minecraft, and here we are with episode 4. Oh, are they looking swanky? Hey. Hi. Alright, so, I have been busy between episodes. So, um, lots and lots of mining, as you can see all the blocks here are gone. And that is because I have now got an abundance of materials in here, including Neverack, but we'll get to that in a bit. And so we had this route to start with, and what I have done initially is expand my base. So I've got the third room here, and then I also, alongside, built a long room. Which, by the way, whilst I'm here, I think I need to finish... Where did I put it? Is it in here? Yes. I need to finish just glassing the roof. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Always make things more difficult than what they need to be. But just so that I don't get rained on when I'm stood in my room. Now this room will come in handy later, but this is not where the, the majority of stuff is going to be long term. This will just be stuff that needs to be close to being outside, like farming or magic mods. There we go, that room's finished. And I need to scoot down this way. Fill in this side quickly. Just like that. Okay, and now we are totally watertight. I need to put some doors in here, but... All right, let's get back to it. So I'm just gonna sleep through the night quickly, and we'll get into it. All right, uh, is that finished? Yes, I've got some extra glass for whatever. Uh, that's the wrong way. In here. In there. So you can see we've got a lot less. Uh, wow. There's one thing I've been collecting from the Never. It's a lot of magma blocks, but we'll get to why we need that later. But my um, materials chest is a lot less cluttered than what it was because all of the things I've got a lot of are now in these storage drawers and all the materials are now in my pocket storage. So, like I said, I did build a Never portal. Where'd he go? Okay, I was thinking about um, going to the Never and getting Obsidian that way, but there was one of them broken Never portals down here, and I had just enough Obsidian to be able to build a portal. So that's there. Hello, Whirly Sprig. That's kind of cool. Ars Nouveau. Gonna be getting into that later. All right. So other than that, that's what I've been doing, and like I, oh, hello, dude. He's got a helmet, so he's not burning. Come here. Wonder if that's a named helmet. Windswept. Ooh, ten percent speed. I will take that. Thank you very much. Okay, so. Yes, 39 diamonds. So there's a load of stuff I wanted to make today. Well, maybe not just today, but other days as well, because this is a lot. Now, I wasn't able to upgrade the battery on my mining gadget because I didn't have never quartz, but now I have never quartz. So I'm going to um, do a thing and I'm going to take a stack of lapis, put that in there. A few stacks of redstone, because I'm going to need a lot of that. Um, gimme. Hmm. There we go. A stack of lapis. Uh, lapis. A stack of nether quartz. Um, I'm going to need some gold. I'm going to stick that into the pulverizer, take that niter out. I'm doing the sand into glass. Uh, there we go. 
What else do I need? Diamonds, of course. Okay, so tier one requires this. Oh, I need my painter glass as well. I forgot about that. Uh, there we go. Glass paint. Right. Tier one battery upgrade requires a blank upgrade Majobi. Give me them back. And then we've got Never Quartz. Okay, so that is off the list. And then to get to tier two, we need two iron ingots and two blocks of quartz. And I think a block of quartz is just four. Yeah. Two of them. And I've got a couple of iron ingots there. Perfect. So then we hit that. And that's our battery upgrade. So that gets removed. So as you can see, each tier, so tier one requires the blank thing. And then tier two requires the tier one and blah, 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 so on, so on. As you can see, I want to get up to tier four efficiency, which will be mining speed. But um, that requires a lot of redstone. So six, 10. I need 12 blocks. So I'm just going to um, do that quickly. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten, eleven, twelve. Put that back in. And then I need my blank upgrade. One of you. Hold that back. And then we go like this. One. Two. Three. Oh, put that in there. And four. Awesome, awesome. So now we do the same old thing. Mining gadget goes in there. Already got the three by three. Battery goes in. Efficiency goes in. And now it needs a lot of charging. Look at it. Look at that model. That's awesome. <clears throat> All right. Um, so it now holds 5 million charge instead of 1 million. And this is still charging. But it's now going to mine a hell of a lot faster than what it did before. So I'm just going to put some charge in here. I can remove all these from my list. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, so I'm just going to show you how fast this damn thing mines. Because now it is legit insane. Ready for this? Wow, we did a lot in the first eight minutes of this video for a change. Watch this. Look at that. That is a thing of beauty right there. It's going to make my little mining excursions in between episodes so much less painful. God, it's all water. Seriously. I'm going to have to fix that. <sighs> Unfortunately. Um, so I can do this. Take out half a stack of that. Okay. And then we go down there, down there. Right. <clears throat> And that's going to be flowing all the way down there. So we're not going down there. <laughs> and then we just go. Pa! That's going to make things so much better. Like I spent a lot of time mining the first episode before I got in between episodes before I got the mining laser. And that made it better. But now, pfft, now we're cooking. Put all that stuff we've already got. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. So I'm just going to um, throw all this stuff. Because that can go into my pocket storage. As can that. I thought I had coal in my pocket storage. Maybe not. Okay. Okay, the water's gone from there. But it's probably still flowing down there. need to get some more waystones. I'll explain more about that when I find another one. And it's raining. Beautiful. Okay. Um, yeah, I should put this stuff away. So just excuse me for a moment here. Don't need to do that. Um, 
Kiwi can go in there, as can glass panes. Don't think I need more glass panes, I do need that. I'll keep that handy. You can go back into my pocket storage, and then I can just go. Tin in there. Okay, what's next? Um, I was going to do an energy cell, but I'm going to skip that for a minute. And I am going to go up to the next tier of pocket storage because that gives me another 16 items. But most importantly, up to 65,500 items of each thing. That's insane. And I've got the diamonds for it now. So that's that. Uh, so I need two pistons, which means I'm going to need... One, two. I needed four diamonds. Yep. Two iron. Um, some wood. Some cobble. Should be good now. Let's see. A uh, piston. One, two. Oh, yeah, we need a couple of chests. Ten. Team, that's good. Now we just go around like that. A couple of chests. One, two, three, four. That should be it. Yes. And that's perfect. So that's now tier three means I've got all these empty slots to put other stuff in there. Perfect. It's another thing off the to-do list. Okay. Next. Um, we are going to go for the exchanging gadget. Because I don't want to live in a cobblestone hut forever. It looks... Ugly. I mean, it's just how it is, right? So, um, exchanging gadget, two lapis, two diamond, one redstone, four iron, perfect. Was it one diamond, two? Oh, God, my memory, I swear to God. Right, okay. Okay, what else? Four, eight, nine, four. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay, we've got that. That's good. Now, this doesn't take much power. So I can just let that go for a bit. And I'll show you something to do with that maybe in the next couple of episodes. He could sit there for now and that's off the list. I also want a destruction gadget because... Yeah. Destroying things. <laughs> no, because um, it's a good way to clear out huge areas in, in like a really short amount of time at the cost of power, which I'm not exactly bothered about yet, although I'm probably going to be soon. Uh, what else? So I need some iron now, which is not ideal. Um, want three, because that'll give me four. Ooh. Okay, the copper went in. Well, that sucks. Hurry up. Could I uh, show you what time in the bottle does here? All right, watch this. Meow. And that's only three clicks. You can go way faster than that. But I don't really have the power at the moment. Another thing I did was move the um, wind turbine up onto my roof rather than being alongside the building. One, because it was in the way of the third room over there. And two, because the higher up it is, the more power it produces. Bottom line. One, two, three. I'm surprised no mob spawned in that time, to be honest. Uh, we need you to speed up a bit. Let's go. This is going to take forever to let. We really need to look into power generation. Like ASAP at this point. Um, right. Destruction gadget. 
two ender pearls. Perfect. That's that done. Another one off the list. Okay, lead and a gold and some redstone. So I'm going to get a stack of redstone out of here for now. Uh, lead, lead, lead. There we go. One, two, three. That should get me four ingots. <clears throat> Although not necessarily. So what are those? Oops. Things. It's always just one gold, two redstone like that. And the reason we're getting this is because this can charge things that are in your hand. So we can give our... Um, mining gadget a little bit extra charge which is nice amongst other things that we might be carrying as well like that carries a million that carries 500k let's just um try and get that filled up all right there's our lead four as promised okay i think we're good yes cool got a flex capacitor bye bye I don't know why coal is in there. And then we've got an energy flux cell frame. So four glass, Electrum. Okay, so Electrum is gold and silver dust. How do I get Electrum bl bl blend is the question. Um, okay, we just combine them. So gold and silver. So if I just go like this and then I've got silver here somewhere. One, two, three, four. And what you can do with these machines, if you don't want it to go into the redstone furnace, you just go into there and turn off auto output and input. And then I'm just going to give that a speed boost. So I'm going to give that a speed boost. Wow, we got an extra gold dust. Cool. Kinda. Um, that was not what was intended. Okay, so we're going to um, put that in there. Then we're going to put our Electrum in there. See how much power is draining? It's like draining so much power when you do that. Okay, so we've got Electrum. That's good. So I need that iron nuggets. There we go. Oh, I picked up two by mistake. Sort that out in a minute. I want one of them. And I want all this back. You can go back in there. And then I need all glass, was it? Let's see. Oh, we need four more lead. Of course we do. Three or, and then we're gonna um, do the things. Oops, didn't mean to do that. Uh, what's in here? Really? Oh yeah, I didn't turn this back on. Auto output, auto input. There we go. Okay. And now we can make that. And then what do we need to do to make it a flux out? Oh, cured rubber. I forgot about that. Okay, that's something to do in between episodes then. All right, cool. Uh, yep. So I'm going to take that off. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to look at extreme reactors. And what this is going to require is that I have a lot of iron and a lot of coal because I need to um, make a lot of steel. So let me have a look at the reactor controller. So reactor casing is graphite and no, it's iron, not steel. That's good. And then sand in the middle. We need a ton of these. So what I'm going to do is um, add the reactor to that. Add some reactor glass. We're going to need fuel rods, control rod, access port, 
Forge Energy Power Tap. Yes. We don't need any of the reinforced stuff. Did I put the controller on there? No, I did not. We need that. Oh, it's a thunderstorm. That's a fluid pot. We don't need any of the other stuff. So those are the things we need for next episode when we're going to get into um, extreme reactors. I'm going to need to go and farm for a whole bunch more um, iron. That's for sure. All right. And I need to uh, tidy up my inventory. I can uh, get rid of that. Thank you. Keep all this in here for later. Uh, that should be charged now. Yes, I'm going to put that one in there. That takes a million, so that's going to take a while. These are both fully charged, right? Yeah. We'll let that go. Good. All right, so I'm going to show you where I my never spawn ended up being. What is that? Oh, it's a moth. Okay. I've had a few things coming through the portal already, but it's not been too bad. All right. So I came out all the way up here, and I am wearing something that's gold, which means the pigmen are going to hate me. And I haven't got as much health now. But what I did find was that, like, if I, you know, sacrifice a bit of fall damage here, and, um, you know, just, you know, self-harm. What I found was the Walked Forest is the biome in the nether where Endermen spawn. Look at them all on the minimap. Loads of them. It's absolutely awesome. There's an Enderman here, right here somewhere. Where is he? There he is. <laughs> and what that means is, even though they're horrifically loud, um, basically means that I can just like troll around here a bit. Hey Enderman, I can see you. Come down here. Come on. There we go, little guy. I can farm Ender Pearls, which I am definitely very happy about because that was one thing I was worried about in this particular pack. But I'm just glad I am so close. Where you at, bro? You up there? Oh, there's an Ender Mini. Whoever thought that up as a good idea for this pack? Absolute devil of a human being. Like, absolute heathen. Mini Enderman. Seriously. Oh, look, he's all the way up here. Coolness. And he disappeared. Where'd he go? Ah! See, this is why I hate Mini Enderman. And you get to witness my first death. Ermergerd. Welcome to modded Minecraft. Ow. Take as little damage as possible here because I need to go through here. And at least it gives me a red X on the map so I know where to go to get my stuff. Sort of this way. Dude. I am not a fan of Mini Enderman, I have to say. Gimme. Got my armor. 
cook up my food. Right. I'm just going to remove that from the map because I don't need that there anymore. Now I'm mad. Where'd he go? Now these dudes are just all over the place. Come on. Bring it. And that breaks in a three by two area. Oh my God. Yeah, get out of the way. I want to kill these guys. That was a bad idea. <laughs> there were four Endermen now. And I am in no way prepared for that yet. <laughs> okay, I'm going to stop dying now. Just going to get my stuff and get the hell out. Uh, but you get the idea. I can farm enderpools when I don't go for four endermen at the same time. Ooh, nearly went off the edge there. God. I'm not looking at you. I'm not looking at you. I just want my stuff. I want to get the hell out of here. Now, I do not have... Now, some people might disagree with this, but I do not have cheats enabled in this pack, and yet we can still do this. So if cheats are enabled, but you can still do that, is it a cheat? Some will say yes. I don't really care what someone say. What is the point in this? I mean, it ignores durability damage, but it's gold, so it's going to last about five seconds. Okay. Well, I'm getting rid of that, that, and that. I want that. You there, you there, you there. No, you there, you there. Got my time in the bottle. Got that extra food. That stuff. Okay. Ah, uh, you can go in there too. I'm actually going to bin that thing because it's not got anything else decent about it. Mining speed, reach distance. Yeah, it's kind of pointless. <clears throat> okay, well, I mean... Pfft. That's it for today. I've definitely got my hands full in between episodes to get some a huge amount of iron. I haven't actually looked at these recipes. Redstone's fine. Copper, pistons, iron. Graphite. Graphite is just smelted coal. Just makes a graphite bar, which is nice and easy. Yep. Eulorium, we've got a ton of already. You've seen that already. Reactor glass is just two glass with a reactor casing. Casings we know about. Controller requires diamond, redstone, and a comparator, which is just simple, basic. Recipe stuff. So we've got all the stuff. We just need a ton more iron because I've basically got 67 there, which is going to be about 80 ingots. And that's probably not going to be enough, to be honest. Yeah, I haven't got any more in there. Probably going to need about double that and probably... Yeah, and got about the right amount of coal. So, yep, that's where I'm at. That's this episode over and done with. Hi. That's me for this episode. Take care. I will see you in episode five.